Digital Fleet's messaging platform makes communicating between your dispatcher and your drivers easier and faster than ever. Let's walk through some of the examples and some of the features that help illustrate why this is one of the most powerful communication tools you can have in your fleet. First of all, most dispatchers spend a lot of their time on the map, so we wanted to make it very easy to communicate between the dispatcher and the driver itself. So there's a few features that we've added to make it super easy to send messages to drivers. First of all, you can click on a truck, it will bring a pop-up menu up, and if you click on message, you can message the truck directly from here. We've also added a header, so that when any new message comes in, you'll see that this header will, will pop up with information. So if you click in the upper right hand corner of our app, you'll see all messages that are coming back to the dispatcher. Now one thing to note, this is set up using our tagging feature, so you can create different groups of trucks, plants, etc. Um, to help basically narrow down the, the truck and the messages that you're trying to manage. So in this case, I'm using my own tablet. This is a simulation environment, um, and I'm communicating back and forth between my web app and the tablet. So you'll see this is one of the messages that I just sent myself. Um, now what you can do is you can either mark this as red, or if you see it, you say pumped is backed up, you can click on it, send a quick message. So I'll just tell them, okay, I will let the other drivers know. and send it, and you'll see that it's sent. Um, and if you look in the lower corner, it will tell you when it was delivered. So in this case, my tablets received the message. I'm gonna acknowledge it back by clicking OK on my tablet, and now the driver's acknowledged. So you can see how fast this works and how easy it is to communicate. Now the driver has several options if he wants to communicate back and forth as well. He can use a canned message or voice to text, um, but the, the real idea is that he no longer has to use the radio and he can use the tablet itself um, in order to communicate back with dispatch. So from there, you can go and using our uh, navigation side panel, you can go into messaging. And now when you first come in, it will show you all the messages um, that are associated with your dispatch. Again, tags fall into this. So if you have certain plants or certain trucks that you remove, you won't see those messages. Um, but in this case, we have all the messages that are going through. So there's a few things to note about the toolbar on the side. Uh, we call these channels. And so all, the channels show the history of all the messages going to that channel. So in this case, there's channels based on trucks, orders, and then you can create groups. The nice thing about the groups is you can do it based on your tags. You can send a meet, uh, message to your entire fleet. Let's say you have a safety message that you want to send to your entire fleet every morning. You can easily go into the groups um, and send a message to your entire fleets. So if you click on any one of the channels, it will bring up the history of that, um, of that uh, channel.